R. Sambandan had been ailing for some time and he breathed his last at a private hospital in Colombo last night. Tomorrow, the remains of the late Sambandan will be placed at a private parlour in Colombo for the public to pay their respects throughout the day. The Committee on Parliamentary Business decided that the late R. Sampandan's body will be placed in the front hall of the Parliament complex on Wednesday from 2 pm to 4 pm. It a pass say to Magi district one at Trigram letter, they gave a Genianova, a hey, Kavada, the Antima, Vadagar to Karane Gela Tamati Nekarlana, Enamut, Irida, Davasa, Kela Tamai, Danata, Abi, Itan. R. Sampanthan, born in 1933, was a respected lawyer by profession. His political journey began when he secured a parliamentary mandate by winning the Trincomalee district in the 1977 general election. Over the years, he served as an MP during various terms, including from 1977 to 1983 and 1997 to 2000. Notably, R. Sambandhan held the position of the 14th opposition leader in the Sri Lankan parliament. He was also a member of parliament serving from 2001 until his passing. From 2015 to 2018, he also led the opposition. His unwavering advocacy for the Tamil community will remain an indelible part of his political legacy spanning over half a century. Sri Lankan President Ranil Vikramasinghe expressed deepest condolences on the passing of R. Sampandan. In a post on X, the President said that as a national leader, R. Sampandan worked tirelessly to bridge the divisions in our country. Prime Minister Dinesh Gunawardena in a statement said that R. Sampandan, being a central and decisive factor in Tamil national politics, directly stood for the ideology of his faction as a leader of the Tamil National Alliance and as a common leader of the Tamil people. Opposition leader Sajid Premadasa said that the late Sambandhan's dedication to equal rights for all Sri Lankans is a beacon of hope. In a post on X, Sajid Premadasa said that the late Sambandhan's fair and just leadership will continue to inspire him and many others. Former Sri Lankan President Mahindra Rajapaks said that the passing of R. Sambandhan is a loss to Sri Lanka's political fraternity. Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi also issued a message of condolence on X. Narendra Modi said that he will always cherish fond memories of meetings with R. Sampandan, adding that the late statesman relentlessly pursued a life of peace, security, equality, justice and dignity for the Tamil nationals of Sri Lanka. Indian External Affairs Minister Dr. S. Jaishankar said he was deeply saddened to hear about the passing away of Sri Lankan Tamil leader R. Sampandan. He said that the late Sampandan dedicated his entire life fighting for the equality, dignity and justice for Tamils in Sri Lanka. US Ambassador to Sri Lanka Julie Chung in a post on X said that she was deeply saddened to hear the passing of MP R. Sampandan, a veteran Tamil politician who worked to create a cohesive, peaceful society within Sri Lanka. She said that his advocacy for equal rights for minorities helped advance broader human rights for all Sri Lankan citizens and encouraged unity.